Six got blah blah. Six got blah blah. Six got blah blah. What's up, you guys? So I'm about to do the half marathon right now, and we'll see how that goes. I'm about to run 13 miles. Today is uh, Saturday. Saturday. March 3rd, um, and it's 6.32 in the morning. I'm at Market Street right now in the Woodlands. So we're about to do this, man. We're about to, we're about to make that leap. And right now, and y'all, when y'all see this video, um, I'm basically, my um, my Snapchat, my Instagram, everything is blacked out. So you guys are wondering what the hell's going on. But basically, yeah, I just quit my job and I'm gonna do personal training, try to train people. Uh, get my body right and then the goal is to open a gym and all that good stuff my homie with my boy Michael So I'm following my dream, you know taking that leap. All right, y'all. I'll keep y'all updated I'm not gonna have this camera uh, with me, but I'll I'll definitely uh, film After the the run and I'll let y'all know how everything goes. All right. Y'all have a good morning, man. I'll take care What's up everyone, so I just finished the uh, 13.1 miles I did it under two hours, so I'm freaking proud of it. Uh, I finished an hour and 58 minutes. Um, halfway through it, my younger brother, Christopher, met me, and uh, he pushed me through it, but basically what I was doing, I was slowing down my breathing, that's what helped me out. Just breathing in uh, from your nose and then breathing out from your free mouth. <clears throat> you have to control it, but I was hurting a little bit under my calves and my hips were hurting, but it's gotta keep going, you know? I did stop, I think I stopped twice, but, um, I just kept going and my younger brother helped me out a lot and I just tried to finish it, you know, and I did it. So I was pretty proud. I thought I was gonna do it under like two hours and 30 minutes, but I did it under two hours. So I'm pretty proud of that. Uh, that was my first half marathon. So here's the medal. Y'all have a good day, okay? Let's go. What's up, y'all? How's everybody doing today? Today's Monday, March 5th, and today's my first day um, with no job, nothing. <laughs> and I'm just checking, you know, of course, training and all that good stuff. But anyways, here's my physical. Michael and I were training for an Ironman. So, I'm at fat percentage, 19.5 fat percentage. What's up, Leo? Say hi to the camera. I'm at 178. This is what I look like right now. Definitely want to lose weight, get this all toned, get this, you know, a six pack or whatever, eight pack and start training, you know. It's about uh, almost six o'clock in the morning. Um, but anyways, but all right, I'll see you on the next one. Hola, what's up, Mike? Huh? Yeah, it's on, bro. What up, man? Hola. 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 <laughs> How you doing? What up, bro, what's up? What's up, man? You about to go run or what? <laughs> about to go swim. <laughs> We're about to go swim right now. Uh, we um, did some biking this morning, did some chess, and now we're about to go swim. First day though, man, it feels awesome. I'm free, first day. We took care of our business cards. I'm freaking excited, son. Huh? How's everybody doing today? So today's Thursday, March 8th. Um, it's about 9.33 in the morning right now. And I just got done training. Two clients. So today's Thursday, basically, uh, my fourth day, uh, or Friday, I quit my job, and then, you know, fourth day of this week. You know, I'm so used to working Monday through Friday, having a set job, and, and again, off of work, and just chilling, because you're done with work, but this is so different. Um, that was gonna be a lot easier, but you really have to, when you don't have a job, I mean, I have, you know, I have clients and everything like that, but you set your own schedule, so you can really get lazy, so you have to push yourself. Um, I'm doing this right now. Uh, I want to, you know, before I, you know, I already started vlogging, but I want y'all to get to know me a little bit more. So I'm Fabian Vargas. I'm uh, 27 years old. I'm from Houston, Texas. Um, my mom is from Mexico, from Acapulco, and then my dad's from Costa Rica. And they met in California, and uh, that's where they met. And I was born over there in California. Um, what else? Um, I love to play basketball. Michael and I, that was our thing. That was our passion back in the day. Basketball was awesome. I don't play as much anymore because I don't want to get hurt. <laughs> What's it called? Uh, my partner and I went went to business for uh, fitness. And he's been doing it for for a while already. He's been doing it for uh, about four years. Training people and all that stuff. And I've always been into fitness too. But I let myself go about a year ago. 
really bad. You know, I was comfortable. I had a girlfriend, all this stuff. And then I gained almost 200 pounds. I was at 195. Um, and then I started training with my best friend. We've been best friends since the fourth grade, Michael. And, um, and we killed it, you know. He, I lost over 30 pounds and I feel awesome. What he did to me, I wanted to do it to other people because it was the greatest feeling ever. So I was like, so I told Michael, hey, you know, I want to become a personal trainer. And we did it, you know, I became a trainer. He taught me a lot of stuff. And then I started learning the ways I like it, you know. So I do it to that to my clients. And, you know, the rest is history. I'm going to start vlogging more. It's hard to get used to it, but I'm going to start vlogging um, definitely more um, just to show. I want to, I want y'all to see my journey where I'm coming from. And uh, I want you to see how, you know, I'm basically, we're start, I'm starting right now. We're just starting this business. It's a starting up company. So I'm, I'm taking to the very beginning to whatever, t whatever it takes us. All right, you guys, I'll see you on the next one. How's everybody doing today? So today is Wednesday, March 14th. It's about 1140. 1151 so we're about to do some work today we're gonna go to the library get some stuff done today we went mike and i went swimming uh ran about three miles and then um and then we just uh we were training our our clients this morning about nine o'clock in the morning so it was a good day so far it's another beautiful day so let's get it let's make it a great day you guys and i'll get you on the next one all right let's do it so right now we're at sweet tomatoes in the woodlands and we're about to freaking eat because this is one of our favorite restaurants. So, let's go check it out. What are you doing, bro? Oh, you had my camera the whole time. <laughs> yeah, it's all. What up, man? You know how we do, man. We're in Houston, <laughs> Texas. Today is March 13th, 2018. Mm -hmm. About to go to Sweet Tomato. It's one of our favorite spots, right? Favorite spot. <laughs> the GOAT. <laughs> what are we looking for, bro? We are looking for equipment. Oh, yeah? Equipment for training. What's up? Oh. <laughs> We're just trying to compare some prices, see what we can get for the better deal, you know. Because we're self-employed, we gotta, you know, get the best deal we got, we can get, you know what I'm saying? So let's check it out. All right, what's up, everyone? So my business cards showed up today. I'm so happy. Look at them. They're beautiful. And in the back, tells you all the good details. But I'm super excited. I ordered about 500 of these bad boys. And then Mike ordered 500 of himself too. They're similar. It's just his face. But I'm super excited. My mom is here and um, she's gonna help me uh, pass them out to her uh, her friends too. Cause my mom's a masseuse and she has her own clients. So she's gonna help me out. Really excited, so good things are gonna happen. I'm gonna pass them out at um, my apartments told me I can give them to them. They'll help me out to pass them out. And I got another apartment. Um, they're going to pass them out for me too. So pretty cool deal. And there's Brownie. This is my other dog. I grew up with him. He's 11 years old. He's a little chihuahua. Hey, Brownie. He's so chill. So right now, we're at our, our elementary. Uh, we went, me and Michael went here. Uh, I started here in second grade. Michael started here, what, in first grade? kindergarten it's called Glenlock it's a playground this is where we started shooting hoops right here the good old days remember Foursquare oh, uh, yeah wall ball yep this is crazy this is the elementary we went to the good old days man we didn't have to worry about nothing just playing basketball living the life it's pretty cool man good memories for sure Really cool memories. Happy we came here. Good morning, how's everybody doing today? So I hope everyone's having a pretty good day so far. Uh, today is St. Patrick's Day, uh, so I'm wearing green. <laughs> Today's Saturday, it's about 10-10 uh, in the morning and I'm about to go um, do some work, do some corn ironing programs i'm gonna meet up with michael so it's gonna be a beautiful day so i am gonna vlog all day today i'm gonna show you what i'm doing in the car where i'm going uh, i have to train somebody at two and then possibly work out too at 24 hour fitness so all right y'all see you on the next clip
What's up everybody, how's everybody doing so far? So right now I'm heading to the library to do some work. So yesterday, um, I read a, I don't know if y'all follow Gary B, one of my fair motivational speakers guy. And I read a quote from him yesterday that really pumped me up and I'll talk about it more uh, when I get back home. Um, but it was so motivating and it's like wake up until you turn to 20, oh, until 29. And I'm 27 right now, so it's like two years left. But basically, I mean, he's just saying, yeah, turn 29, but you can, you can, you can be 30, you can be 40, you can be 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, it don't matter, 99. It's never too late to start what you want to do, you know? I started this journey about two weeks ago, but I'm loving it so far, you know? It's, you know, I have a few, I have clients, you know, and I'm, I'm trying to build up my online uh, clients, but, you know, it just takes time, you know, but you gotta be hustling, you gotta grind, you know? I'm just happy that I'm doing what I wanna be doing, you know? I don't, I don't, I'm not working for nobody, you know, I'm following my dream, you know, this is what I really wanna do, is, uh, you know, what I'm doing, personal training, online coaching, but I'm gonna, I'm, I'm almost to the library, so I'm gonna do some work, and then I'll get y'all on the next clip, all right? All right, you guys. All right, I'll see y'all later. What up, Mike? What are you about to do? You know, man, I'm just here to be great. <laughs> here to get better. That's what's up. Yeah. Say, you're not wearing green today, bro. What's going on? Is that why you wore green? Yeah, I, yeah you're going to get pitched, man. <laughs> Anyways, we'll catch you on later, right? right. Going to Metro or what? Metro flat. All right, really bet. not going to go, but. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Mike, I'll see you later, bro. There we go. <laughs> he hurt me. <laughs> he gets so excited. He gets so excited. Let me see the camera. <laughs> Anyways, I just got home. I'm about to cook some food, and then uh, gonna train uh, two uh, two later. Renisha and Ronika at two o'clock. So, what's up, everybody? So I'm at 24 finish right now. It's about uh, seven. 7:30 basically right now and uh it's really really nice today but anyways we're about to go work out i'm about to do some cycling i'm gonna do a back workout and then do some cardio what's up everybody so right now it's uh 9 22 p.m uh saturday uh the 17th of march uh st patrick's day so i want y'all to listen to something that keeps me motivated it's his name is, um, I think I told y'all earlier today, um, his name is uh, Gary V, uh, one of my favorite motivational speakers. Um, but anyways, I've been listening to this every day and I'll tell y'all how that, how that makes me. It's it. Reality, the problem is nobody cares. Your lack of patience is killing you, slowing you down. Everybody's trying to prove something so early. You fucking wrap your head around not giving a fuck about any advancement to your 29, the 99% that achieve are willing to sacrifice, be persistent, put in disproportionate work, and think in 50 year terms, not 50 day terms. You know, I just started this journey about two weeks ago. I mean, y'all been seeing my uh, my videos when, when I did the half marathon. You know, I quit, I left my job Friday and I did the half marathon Saturday to start my journey, you know? It's all being patient too. Don't stress that, you know, you're starting slow because I mean, it's, for me, it's only two weeks in, you know, and not, I'm not where I want to be at all. You know, I got to get more clients, more customers, um, more online clients. I got to build it up because I want to be, you know, own a gym with Michael and, and inspire more people, you know. So yeah, you're gonna have your ups and downs, but it's okay, you gotta keep pushed through it. You gotta keep going, you gotta keep working, you know. Because if you give up, that's it. You didn't, you gave up. But you cannot give up. You cannot give up. You got to work every day. You got to grind no matter what. Um, so it's all about the journey. It's never too late. I'm 27 years old. It's never too late to start. If you want to, I don't know, open a gym, if you want to open a store, you know, and, you know, save your money, you know, and do what you want to do. You know, I was tired of working for somebody. I couldn't do it anymore. I was good at everything I did. I was a server for PF Chains. Uh, for eight years, uh, and then I worked at uh, uh, what's it called? I worked at a dealership, and then I worked at a at, uh, MW Cleaners. Everything I did, I always I was always good at it. But that's not what I wanted to be. You know, I didn't want to be a server my whole life. I didn't want to drive for a living. I didn't want to do that. This is what I want to do. So I quit my job. I don't know more health care. I don't have a consistent paycheck. I got to hustle to make money now because I. I gotta pay rent. I gotta pay bills. Bills don't don't stop. They keep coming. So I gotta keep hustling and hustling and keep grinding. That was a scary part, but I did it. I, I did. A, I built a cushion, and I did it. You know? 
But anyways, um, so that's it for this vlog for today. But next time I'm gonna, you know, do like less days and put out more videos, you know. But it's my first time, I'll have to get used to this for sure. I'm gonna start vlogging even more, get more places, not just me as Sophie's, but like just uh, going every day to like, you know, I don't know, to the store, to the groceries, all that good stuff, you know. But anyways, but that's it for this vlog. It's gonna be, I'm gonna call it the pilot because it'll be my first video posted on YouTube. So, but anyways, um, I hope y'all enjoy my video. Uh, please get a thumbs uh, thumbs up and subscribe. I really, 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 really appreciate it. If y'all subscribe and just start following the journey for sure. All right, y'all. We all have a good day. Stay motivated. And what I always say is get better every day. All right. I'll see y'all later.